Hey guys, it's Henry. And it's Jacob. And here we are at the Braintree Lego Store Mall once again. And so first we're going to take a look at the displays here at the Lego Store. It's a little bit crowded, so we'll try to move quickly. Uh, we have the Hogwarts Express, a very long set. We also have the Jazz Club. Along and with the table football, which is very hated, but I do like it. Then on the other side here, we have the Lego City display, as long as a friend set. And, and also some Duke Club. Here right, is so here's the 18 plus area. And let's take a look at that Lion Knight's Castle. That's a very excellent looking set. And then also, right next to it is the Lion Knight. They also have the Eiffel Tower, which has a massive box there. I can't wait to buy that. And the Titanic, and a bunch of other great 18 plus sets with the Lunar New Year display that they always put something special in here, which I like. And here is the Duplo area. <laughs> and then over here is some more 18 plus with some Technic and the Bonsai Tree and Coliseum. And the Ferrari. And we also have the Tahu with Taka with um that only with qualifying purchases unfortunately, but it's a cool promo. And then also over here we have the Star Wars area. They do have the lens speeder on display. Excellent set. And then they also have the AT, -AT. with the Millennium Falcon and all the UCS sets here. To quickly skim. Yeah. So first we got the uh, Aston Martin DBS or so, GB5. So we actually did not get um, one, but we actually got two. So one for each of us because we both do like these cars and we both wanted to have one. At the Lego store, they just look so smoothly finished. And, and they look great. They look really good. And this is, my, this is both of our second Speed Champions. So I guess now me and Henry have the same Speed Champions cars because we just have similar taste. So next, I actually got these Lord of the Rings brickheads. I love how they have that massive brickhead and they didn't up the price of the set. And I was able to use VIP points to actually get this one for almost free. I still had to pay tax, but it was very, it was, a, it's a great set. I do love this one. And next up is the T-Rex breakout, which I was not expecting to buy, but I'm glad I did because it looks to be a great set. And we do have a little bit of a story to tell with this one. So Henry bought some Auntie Anne's at the mall, and he didn't have enough space, so he put the lemonade in the bag. And um, that didn't turn out very well, as you can see. Yeah. It kind of. We're gonna have to maybe. Fine. There's even a little hole, but it's. Wait, did learning. it actually get? Oh, I think it actually got in a little bit there. It's okay. It's a learn. It's just the box, but um, yeah. The review might not be uh, at. We might not be able to show the box because uh, it's a little bit. It, it's a little bit damaged. But yeah, that was a very funny moment. And it's a great set. And now we have the Lego Bowser. This is the one that I got, and the biggest set and the last set was shown in this haul. This one is completely dry, fortunately. It was in a different bag. It was in a different bag, and I would never put drinks with my Legos, but. Anyway, on the front, it works like a puppet, so it's going to go in my Mario course for now until I have a real, like, nice shelving unit. But I do love this one, and on the back, it does show um, the Bowser. It'd be great if it came with the Mario minifigure. There are zero minifigures in this set. But I think that's okay. Yeah, it would be cool if they had Mario minifigures. It's all right. It's not the end of the I world. think it looks crazy good. But... It looks amazing. This is what my favorite Mario set that came out. I would have gotten the Crest Mark block or the NES. But it was, it was awesome having this one, even though this is going to retire the latest. I, I just think this is the best one. So this is the entire haul. And, and I'm really happy with all the sets that we ended up with today. And I'm also, this was a um, birthday trip for me, and I'm really happy that I was able to get some nice stuff. And if you had noticed, in all our other hauls, we got pick cups. But in this time, we decided not to since the pieces weren't great. But, yeah, I'm happy with what we got. Maybe next time. But uh, thank you guys so much for watching. And make sure to come back next time.